Attention sellers, listen up. Hey, it's Paula Tish, your favorite Huntsville realtor. And today I'm gonna to talk to you about the five things that will give you the biggest bang for your buck when selling your home. Number one is gonna be paint. Paint is a simple thing and it can really lighten and freshen your home. If you run through the whole house with a neutral paint color, it will brighten up your rooms, freshen things up. It feels clean and it feels new and people love that. It costs about two to $4,000 to paint about a 2,000 square foot house. If that's not in your budget, just go ahead and do it yourself. I'm sure you'll do a great job. Number two is curb appeal. When people drive up to your house, that's the very first thing they see. And so it's super important that you're putting your best foot forward with your curb appeal. And what that means is making sure your grass is tended well, it, that you don't have any big patches of dirt. If you do, buy some grass seed. It's not very expensive. Throw some grass seed down there. If water your grass, pull the weeds, trim your bushes, put down fresh mulch or Buy some fresh annuals of the season. If it's fall and winter, buy some mums. If it's spring, buy some daisies. Whatever you need to do to freshen it up. So from the curb, when I first drive up with buyers for your house, they will love it. Number three is flooring. Flooring can be an expensive thing to replace, but more and more buyers these days are wanting houses with no carpet. So if you can replace your carpet with LVP or wood floor or something of that kind, that can go a long way with buyers. If having that installed is not in your budget, check Facebook Marketplace and discount stores. Sometimes you can get a small lot of flooring for a very good price and do it yourself. Number four is bathrooms. Okay, I'm not talking gut job your bathroom. We all know kitchens and baths, that's where the money is in these houses, right? But so take a good look at your bathroom and see what needs to be done. Maybe you can just change up the hardware. Maybe it's the light fixture. Maybe it's the countertop. Maybe you have, it needs a whole new cabinet. Maybe you need to reglaze your tub. You can spend a lot of money on a bathroom, but you don't have to. You could paint your cabinet, replace the countertop, put in a new mirror and a new light fixture and reglaze your tub. And it looks fantastic. Again, if that's not in the card, then just make what you have sparkle. Clean the grout, clean the scum, clean the stuff off of it and make it look as good as it possibly can look. Number five, update your light fixtures. Many, many homes have very outdated light fixtures and it's not a super expensive thing to do to update them. A couple hundred dollars and you have a very updated dining room fixture. Now be careful. You do not want to introduce a brush nickel light fixture into your home that has all brass. Keep gold and brass together, keep chrome and brush nickel together, but do not mix and match. You can mix metals, but be careful. And as I've mentioned before, the simple things to do when you're getting your, ready, your house ready to sell is you need to edit. Edit all the things. People want to see it practically empty, so take everything out. Take, just leave the bare minimum in there that defines the room and take everything else out. Rent a storage unit if you have to. And after you've gotten all that stuff out of there, hire a professional cleaner. For a couple hundred dollars, you get a uh, professional cleaning done and it will make it sparkle. Let's recap. Five things you can do to get your house ready to sell that give you the biggest bang for your buck. Number one, paint. Number two, curb appeal. Number three is flooring. Number four, bathrooms, and number five, light fixtures. Which of these are you gonna choose to get your house ready to sell?